15 Interesting Facts About Mercedes-Benz Greetings and welcome to yet another exciting video from us. Today we're going to provide some fascinating and unexpected information about one of the most well-known and enduring companies in the luxury vehicle sector. In this video, Mercedes-Benz is the sole subject of discussion. The Daimler-Benz firm, which was subsequently renamed Mercedes-Benz, was founded in 1926 as a result of the merger of two German automakers, Gottlieb Daimler and Karl Benz. Their first joint vehicle was the 770 model, which Adolf Hitler was rumored to have driven and had a bulletproof windshield. Mercedes-Benz has created some of the most well-known luxury vehicles ever made and has always been a leader in technological and safety innovation. His catchphrase is the best or nothing, Mercedes. Future billionaires can learn a lot from Mercedes-Benz because of their luxurious mindset, progressive methods of thinking, longevity, and drive for success. So, let's look at the first of the 15 interesting facts about Mercedes-Benz. Carl Benz invented the first modern automobile. In 1886, Carl Benz was the first to design and patent a modern vehicle. His automobile, which he dubbed the patent motor wagon, had three wheels, a steel tube chassis, wooden panels, and a little gasoline engine. Carl had to start somewhere, even though it only had two-thirds of the horsepower. The second idea was funded and promoted by his wife Bertha. An 11-year-old girl suggested the name Mercedes. The Austrian diplomat and racing enthusiast Emil Jolinek is responsible for the creation of the Mercedes brand. Insisting that the 36-car series of sports automobiles he purchased from the Daimler business be given the name Mercedes in honor of his 11-year-old daughter. When the cars were finished in 1901, Yellow won every race he contested with them. After the car swiftly gained a solid reputation and Daimler patented the name in 1902, they made the decision to continue with it. The first person to travel by car in a contemporary setting was Bertha Benz. When she and her sons drove the automobile more than 130 miles round trip, Bertha Benz, the wife of Carl Benz, brought attention to the Benz patent motor market on a national scale. She left without notifying her husband, along with her two sons, ages 13 and 15, for the first time she had traveled far in an automobile, attempting to demonstrate the invention's viability. However, seeing cars on the road was unusual for most people. So many people were terrified, and some even believed the horseless carriage was the devil's invention. Along the way, she fixed a number of issues with the car, such as clearing a clogged fuel line with her hatpin and having leather installed by a cobbler when the wooden brakes started to fail. Fourth, Mercedes-Benz has a unique affiliation with the Penske Hotels, which makes them the world's first set of brake pads. This German garden in the Bavarian Alps was introduced by the Ken Penske Hotel. It's a five-star establishment that epitomizes luxury, complete with stunning views, opulent amenities, and first-rate service. During their stay, guests at the hotel get access to the opulent and potent Mercedes-AMG aircraft. They are urged to drive the car on the rocky, twisting mountain roads that encircle a hotel for an unforgettable driving experience. This is a component of the exclusive alliance Mercedes-Benz has with the hotel chain. For its VIP shuttle service, this hotel also uses Mercedes-Benz class and S-class vehicles. This hotel is now the only one in the chain to provide this special option. However, similar agreements will undoubtedly exist in the future. The most costly model to date is the Mercedes Maybach S650 Cabriolet, which comes in at number 5. At the Los Angeles Auto Show in 2016, Mercedes introduced its most expensive vehicle to date. Given that just 300 of the Mercedes Maybach S650 Cabriolets will ever be produced, it is a highly sought-after convertible. It is also the most expensive, coming in at about $320,000. The emphasis is on luxury but high-performance amenities, such as the 621-horsepower turbocharged V12 engine, are included as a bonus. Customers of this vehicle also receive a set of baggage made of the same leather as the seats. The 6th Mercedes-Benz has agreements with upscale hotels to provide drivers with exclusive benefits. Mercedes-Benz wants to assist its owners in extending the luxury of their top-of-the-line automobiles to other facets of life. And one way they achieve this is by collaborating with a few upscale hotels to treat Mercedes-Benz drivers like royalty. Mercedes-Benz owners can receive a free room upgrade, a free 50-minute spa service, a welcome basket, and free overnight parking when they visit a Four Seasons hotel, for instance in Scottsdale, Arizona or Vail, Colorado. A $100 credit towards services, complimentary meals, and drinks are additional privileges provided by a lot of five-star luxury hotels. 
access to mineral pools, cheap admission to attractions, spa packages, and more the three-pointed emblem for number seven was almost given a fourth point. The three points of the Mercedes-Benz logo signify the company's dominance over land, air, and water. Since 1989, when the first three-point star was adopted, the logo has undergone changes. The idea of including a fourth point to indicate space was also brought up. The very first driver's license was issued to Carl Benz in position 8. In the early 1900s, various states and nations began debating whether or not to provide driver's licenses. However, Carl Benz holds the distinction of being the first person to obtain a license to drive a car in 1888. After receiving numerous complaints about the noise and odor of his first contemporary automotive prototype in his neighborhood, he asked the local authorities for official authorization. The ninth, the S-Class, now has a functional system to create a strong feeling for the perfume atomizer that would be offered in S-Class models. Renowned perfumer Mark Vaughn on day was enlisted. The fragrances, which go by the names Free Side Mood, Sports Mood, Nightlife Mood, and Downtown Mood, were all created with the concepts of luxury and quality of life in mind. The Mercedes-Benz Cesar AMG, which is ranked 10, boasts store hinges that can burst at 180,000 revolutions per minute. Mercedes-Benz S-Class AMG is still a well-liked exotic automobile today, despite only being produced from 2011 to 2015. The going doors are one of the car's distinguishing features and Mercedes-Benz even designed explosive charges inside the hinge pins so that, after a brief period of time, pulling on the door handles would set off the explosives. The business included this function to ensure the safety of their clients and to meet federal regulations that require a door to be operable in the case of a rollover collision. Arnold Schwarzenegger, Tom Hanks, Roger Federer, Eddie Murphy, Al Pacino, and Floyd Mayweather are among the celebrities who possess this vehicle. Watch our movie of the top 10 most costly Floyd Mayweather automobiles by clicking on the top right corner to see what other high-end vehicles Mayweather owns. Pope Benedict most frequently employs one of the popes. Although Pope Francis currently prefers to travel in more modest automobiles, such as a modified Ford Focus, Jeep Wrangler, and Fiat 500, the 16th was a Mercedes-Benz. Pope Benedict, the 16th's go-to papal vehicle, was a modified Mercedes-Benz M-Class SUV that featured a special glass-enclosed compartment, with its own oxygen supply and a white leather chair with gold trim that was hoisted into a glass enclosure by a hydraulic lift. Additionally, it was built with bulletproof plexiglass windows a bulletproof top, and armored side panels that provided defense against explosives and bomb blasts in addition to gunfire. They developed a self-driving semi-truck at number 12, which cost about $450,000. With the debut of their future truck, Mercedes provides a glimpse into the automation of the future. Concept car for 2025. The truck also has LED illumination that changes from white to blue depending on whether it is being driven or is in autonomous mode. The road and traffic are scanned by radar sensors and the camera. The driver can unwind in the meantime in seat 13's swiveling position, which has numerous display screens, a tablet in the center console, curved wood flooring, and ambient lighting. Hitler gave the King of Nepal a Mercedes as the country's first automobile. In 1940, Adolf Hitler delivered a Mercedes-Benz of the 1939 model to the King of Nepal as a special present. The massive vehicle had to be carried by multiple workers for several days due to the poor state of the country's roadways. To the nation's capital, up until his passing in 1955, he often utilized the car to transport people out. The vehicle started to corrode after that and was even used for a while by an engineering college. Mechanic training. It is currently on display in Museum No. 14. The Mercedes-Benz of a Swiss businessman was listed for roughly $10 million. Julian Maker, a Swiss businessman, employed 35 guys who contributed more than $30,000 in labor to transform his Mercedes McLaren SLR into the red and gold car of his dreams. With 25 layers of red paint, 5 kilograms of gold dust, 24 karat gold wheels, gold headlamp and door sill trim, jeweled indicators, a gold trim steering wheel, and switchgear set in rubies. The upgrades alone cost more than $5 million. The interior of the car is decorated with more than 600 rubies. Its 5.4-liter engine's power was also increased, going from 640 to 999 horsepower. In 2011, the billionaire offered his vehicle for sale, making it the most costly vehicle at roughly $10 million. The third most expensive vehicle ever sold at auction is number 15, 
1954 Mercedes-Benz W196. The only 1954 Mercedes-Benz W196 race car, not stored in a museum or owned by Mercedes-Benz. This record-breaking automobile won nine Grand Prix qualifying events for the 1954 and 1955 World Championships. It was sold at auction in the UK in February 2016 for $30,433,000. Mercedes-Benz set a record with this sale, making it the third most expensive vehicle ever to be sold at auction, after a Ferrari 50 GTO and a Ferrari 335S. Do you think Mercedes-Benz belongs among the top three luxury automobile manufacturers of all time now that you know more about the company? If not, please tell us who does in the comments section below. At that point, thank you for remaining. For your benefit, 46,000 workers were compelled to work in Daimler-Benz factories during World War II in order to aid Nazi war efforts. Thank you for your time. The corporation eventually made restitution payments to the families of the workers, totaling around $12 million in 1988. If you want more, make sure to subscribe so you never miss a video.